Vajra is a term used in South Asia, in particular, in India, to refer to trans women, male to female transsexual or transgender individuals. 1 2. In other which areas of India, transgender people are also known as Aravani, Aruvani or Jagapa. In Pakistan and Bangladesh, the Hijras are officially recognized as third gender by the government, 4 5, being neither completely male nor female. In India also, transgender people have been given the status of third gender and are protected as per the law despite the social ostracism. The term more commonly advocated by social workers and transgender community members themselves is qua asira and can identify the individual as a transsexual person, transgender person, kazres, cross-dresser, zenanas, or eunuch, nanbans. Hijras have a recorded history in the Indian subcontinent from antiquity onwards as suggested by the Kama Sutra period. This history features a number of well-known roles within subcontinental cultures, part gender liminal, part spiritual and part survival. In South Asia, many Hijras live in well-defined and organized all Hijra communities, led by a guru. 8-9 these communities have sustained themselves over generations by adopting young boys who are ejected by, or flee, their family of origin. 10. Many work as sex workers for survival. The word hijra is an Urdu Hindustani word derived from the Semitic Arabic root hjr in its sense of leaving one's tribe, and has been borrowed into Hindi. The Indian usage has traditionally been translated into English as eunuch or hermaphrodite where the irregularity of the male genitalia is central to the definition. 13, however, in general hijras are born with typically male physiology, only a few having been born with intersex variations. Some hijras undergo an initiation right into the hijra community called nirwan, which refers to the removal of the penis, scrotum and testicles. Since the late 20th century, some hijra activists and Western non-government organizations NGOs, have lobbied for official recognition of the hijra as a kind of third sex or third gender, as neither man nor woman. 15. Hijras have successfully gained this recognition in Bangladesh and are eligible for priority in education. 16. In India, the Supreme Court in April 2014 recognized hijra and transgender people as a third gender in law. Nepal, Pakistan, India, and Bangladesh have all legally recognized the existence of a third gender, including on passports and other official documents.